absolutely terrific game from Alan Smith so, and myself, Martin Tyler. It's Goodbye been for now. absolutely wonderful to watch again. What? Are oh, you fucking kidding me? Three goals I put past him. He's got man of the match. What the fuck? Bullshit. Three goals I put past him. There we are. I am sixth. Still five points behind uh, Chelsea, but never mind. I'll live. Right, I've got, a, I've got a match against Aston Villa, but then I've got a must win, and it is a massively, massively must win game against Malmo. Um, so I've got to really think about the team that I'm going to put out for this one. It's an away match as well. Let's have a good look at this. I think I'm going to uh, bin this formation because I'm not, I'm not liking it at all. Four one two one two. I'm going to go with that. I'm going to try it. It doesn't give me the wingers, but am I having much luck out the wing anyway? To be honest, no, I'm not. So, um, win. Tiger and Cats, Shimanga. I'm all right with that. Right, Gilvaz. I don't want you there, fella. I want. Um, is Camon really good at fucking like strength and shit? It's not really, is he? Standard tackle, yeah, he's pretty good actually. Um, so let's stick him there. Go Vaz on the right. Uh, Melito on the left, please. Central attacking, that's Discarud, yeah. Sigurdsson and Barini. Right, so, normally that would be George actually, so let's stick him in there. Um, yeah, looking at this, you know, all my guys have got full full strength. I'm going to bring my key players off halfway through the second half. So, we'll go with that. That looks pretty decent to me. 4 one 2 one 2 But I've eventually got that guy who's going to run onto the balls, because that formation I had... Last time I was begging for somebody just to come running in, there was nobody there as you've seen. Very frustrating for me. Now Sigurdsson's got on the scoring list. So it's Carmona. I'm hoping Barini can. I really need Barini in full flow. I need, to, I need him to start fucking stepping up. I keep saying this. But I really do need it. Give us your insight onto the away team today, strength and weaknesses. Some average ones, but I think rightfully they are in mid-table. They deserve to be there, and I can see that continuing for the rest of the season. Barini's going to run onto this one. Shots on here. Oh, Fuck so he's got gang banged in the middle of the box there. Maybe a Dell. This crew's already fucked, so I don't know what he's been doing. But he's already fucked. He must have had a wank before the game or something. Oh, fuck me. One move! One move took my central defender out there. And that was it. Villa was in. I'm just showed you, isn't it? One wrong move, and that is it. Curtains. It's good. It's a good sim. Super pass. Barini! Straight at the keeper. He loves doing that. He loves feeding the keeper. I swear the fucking opposition pay him off every time. Oh, there we got it. That motor should have been there. Should have been in that exact spot. That was 
ridiculous. How the fuck did he manage to get through everybody? Two defenders there, that ball got through. One. And then my entire defence is just cut into fucking pieces. Fuck's sake. Sigurdsson's running on to the end of this. In fairness though, Carmona as the central defensive mid did absolutely shit there. Barine is going to run on to the end of this, it's whether or not he's going to get to it, yes he is. There's the equaliser, Diskerud in that central attacking mid place, blasts it in and that is the place that I think that he plays best, I don't know why. Now I probably was desperate of, of mixing things around. Well, look at the space that he had there. It was just begging for him to smash it in. One all. Look at that. Bullshit. I won the ball back and then somehow he just fucking nicks it back. Oh, what play that was. Sigurdsson is through. Oh, what a save. What a save to deny Sigurdsson a fucking goal there. And we can have a check on some other scores coming in. Nicely done between the two of them. Oh, fuck me. Who was in the fucking... Craig Gordon, you're shitting me, aren't you? Not this time, shot. Oh, you twat! That was with your right foot as well! What's wrong with you? That's twice in two games that the goalkeeper's given you the ball and you've totally fucked it up. Amazing! How do you feel? How do you feel? Well, that's not a fucking fault. Piss off! Send him off. Send him off for being a twat. What the fuck? Call that fucking control. Visiting Villa Park is one of the great thrills as a commentator. Wonderfully historic stadium. Look at that. Why hit it so far ahead of yourself? You don't see the computer doing that. So why are you doing it? That's a real tussle for the ball. Arteta. Fuck off. I'm pressing the other direction. Why is he running straight out with it? Position for Aston Villa. An update for you on what's happening elsewhere. Arteta. Good ball towards Barini. Ball across towards Sigurdsson. What the fuck was that? I don't understand how Sigurdsson is nowhere near the ball. He jumps and falls over like some sort of twat. And all my players do it. It's not just Sigurdsson. They all fucking do it. Must be some kind of ritual that they do in the fucking training ground, is it? Send him off. This is something that we've... Now I've got to Ref! To the what the he fuck? He got in the middle of the play there, I was through. Hasn't booked him. And it's good to see that he has given him the real goalkeeper might be needed again. Where's Nolito? Where is Nolito and why wasn't he in that position there to get that rebound? He's blocked it there. What a surprise. Fabian Dell. What are you doing? It's a great ball. And he 
he gets it back again quickly. He's read that well to right. intervene. We finished half the time. Half here. <laughs> so there's still a second half to come. <coughs> half time, it's one off. Very evenly matched teams at the break. Yeah, I think both defences have been on top. And, uh, in fact, Not too bad so far. Not to too bad tight. at all. Past that. Oh, somehow managed to keep it in as well. Amazing. Look at that bullshit. Every time you go for a shot, it doesn't matter where you are. Stick a fucking foot in. For fuck's sake, this guy's shit. Get out of the fucking way, you fucking knobhead! Why do that? No person in their right mind would step in the way of that kind of fucking thing. But no, because it's a computer, of course. I can't control that shit. That is bullshit, because I did... What the fuck? I pressed that fucking sprint button straight ahead, not at an angle. But what a surprise, I didn't win the header either. Catch him if you can. There was no I did. chance. Only one winner in that race. Good play together. Maybe a chance. Great chance. George! Fucking hell. Team really battling to take the lead. At the moment, it's still all square. Oh, lost possession here. Carmona. Uh, Fuck off with these ridiculous blocks. Mark Albright. So they just managed to fucking get in the way of you, and that's it. It's fucking stupid. Going, Sigurdsson. I was gonna pass to you, and he fucked off the other side of him. Gabriel Icon Lahore. It's James Collins. The ball's taken from them, they've lost it now. Great ball. He's in a goal, right forward. Oh, come on. This is ridiculous. Can only put it behind for the corner. But well, we're still level here. And we're going to have a 
substitution is this the way to alter the match in their favour that's a, a volley of goal working hard to try and get the goal that will put them into the lead What the fuck? Carmona, well this is the type of player who's such a role model for the would-be players because his I don't, You know what I mean? There's just nobody else there. There's nobody else there. Nathan Delfonso. Side rare. Carmona. Well, both teams will still fancy they've got a chance of winning this game. But time is ticking away. They've licked up well. Give them a chance maybe to get their noses in front. Didn't quite happen. way this one's going to go with five minutes to go score still level and is this the moment for them still danger and eventually this one should have scored the first time but it's it straight at the keeper in many ways this is the great appeal of the game and then that team that's given little chance can win a short great stuff done with this late goal. Yeah, and I think every single individual has played at the maximum as opposed to the opposition. Needed to keep the entire team. squad on to be honest, just to try and get this result. Go until the last minute and you might just get your reward and they have here it seems. Win the header and then it's some stupid like that. Nathan Del Ponce. Come and get the ball, I ain't fucking playing it, because last time I did this, fucking Dortmund fucking scored a last minute fucking goal, this is a twat. So by all means, come and get the fucking ball, I don't give a shit. Very good passes. This team are passing the ball beautifully. Nicely done between the two of them. Oh, you're joking me. Have you seen this? He never even stuck his foot out. I don't know what else I can do. All he needed to do, look at that bullshit. Why is he trying to hit it with his right? Why? Why is he trying to hit that with his right? He just looks like a total twat. And, that's it. and I somehow didn't win the header again. And possession again. Fucking smack on that bastard. Have it. And another goal would wrap it all up. Corner into a decent area, but nothing quite. And here's a shot now. Excellent. How can you block someone that's coming at you that fucking fast? Bullshit. Look at it. It's ridiculous. Come on, is going to whip another one in. Sagenston. Oh, I was fucking yes. Okay, two one anyway. Barini is sent off because I got pissed off. It's annoying. This game somehow it works for the fucking defenders. It's ridiculous. So another game passes in this exciting season. I do hope you've enjoyed. Bye. Hopefully, this next match will be a win as well, and we can still carry on with this Champions League. Hopefully, fingers crossed.